That's right. At the last video, we were talking about population standard deviation and sample standard deviation. Oh, that's right. So we were talking about standard deviation. Oh, man. You know what? Many people had a problem on this one. See? So the first thing, yeah, long time ago, I had a problem. I didn't understand. See? But I was right on this one because I used the, uh, the formula. All I did, just plug me in, then I got the answer right when I was in high school. Uh, but uh, I took many, many years to understand what's going on. Then, okay, standard deviation. That's right. The formula-wise, step number one. That's right. So we have to subtract this mean value from this each datum. That's right. Each value. Okay, so 142 minus 141, which is 1, right? Okay, what about this one? Oh, so minus 141, which is negative 3, and so on, right? Now, uh, all we need is just the positive answers. In other words, absolute value, okay? Because we study like a 2 of positive, negative, doesn't matter. That was the mistake by 2, see? So that's why... We're using this absolute value, which is 1, 3, 2, 2, 1, 5, 6, 2, 4, 6. That's it. Now, we square that one. So, I'm going to square everything, okay? So, 1 times 1 is 1. 3 times 3, 9, 4, 4, 1, 25, 36, 4, 16, 36. Oh, great. Then we found our sum, which is we add everything. Okay, so add, oh, just like this one. Very easy, basic. Its total is 136, right? Then divide by how many numbers? <laughs> so that means, oh, 136 divided by total. 10. So, then 13.6. Then, we put square root on it, right? Right there. So, uh, let's make a formula then. Uh -huh, that's right. See, first two steps right here, you subtracted mean value from each value, right? Okay, each number right here. That means each number, like I said, okay, x I, right? Which is X1, X2, X3, all the way to 10. Okay, so actually up to that point, we're talking about, oh, XI minus, oh, X line on the top, which is the subtraction, but like I said, absolute value, right? See? It's a positive number. Then square everything. Oh, then, okay, we're talking, okay, so XI, okay, minus X. Okay, so mean value, then square, see? Then let's add everything, see? So let's add everything means, oh, we use what? That's right, sigma sign, right? Capital sigma. Okay, then, oh, we're talking about sigma sign, just like this. So I is 1 through, in this case, 10, okay? So which is N, okay? Then, uh, then we just put this information right there, right? So also, this is going to be squared anyway. So it's going to be a positive anyway. So we don't have to worry about this absolute value sign. Okay, so, okay, x, i, minus, okay, so mean value, then square. See, square means positive anyway. Then divide by number. Oh, that's why up to that point, again, so sigma, Oh, we talk about this one many, many times. Don't worry. So, okay, now, N. Okay, then, X, I, minus X value, then square. But you're going to add everything, then divide by 10, right? Oh, that's it, divide by 10. Now, so we were talking about this one at the last video. Okay, depends on this is going to be 10 or 9. Oh, that's big trouble. That's okay, because, okay, so you're going to decide this is going to be like a population standard 
or, or population mean or uh, sample mean okay depends on your area maybe your hospital your bank maybe okay depends on you gotta ask your boss that's the best uh, uh, choice right now what about at the school so you gotta ask your teacher before you take a test then you gotta ask your teacher so this matter okay gonna be like a population or sample matter now oh uh, yeah we have that one so uh, then we gotta put what square root sign on the top oh that's it so now that one this value right here so we call SD we call one SD we double this one double this one then we call two SD three times three SD doesn't matter also this one okay so we use the sign right there oh so you can see this sign right there which is lowercase sigma that's it see large uh, capital letter sigma looks like this right that's sigma but this one is this one means standard deviation or sample case okay sample case obviously this number going to be what okay 9 right because on 10 minus 1 okay in that case actually we use a small s okay right there that's for sample case but don't get confused okay make it simple okay for now divide by 10 then you put square root sign on the top also this answer right here okay so I put four digits after point okay 3.6878 but you can uh, you, you have to follow the instructions see like I said you have to ask your boss or teacher so whoever okay maybe this is gonna be usually two digits after point so which this is gonna be round rounded up so 3.69 okay that's the one SD now hey we're gonna uh, refresh this one okay so first of all so you have each value right so oh each value just like this one then actually I means okay what okay Sigma that's addition so I will be 1 through n okay so uh, population uh, standard deviation case this is gonna be capital letter anyway so uh, no big deal okay no difference anyway so now okay minus okay then X then this one okay you added everything or oh, actually square first right then you square first then add everything so it's gonna be positive anyway then divide by one number right in that case it's gonna be small I use the small n right there small uh, lowercase n right there now I just drew this one Wow one beautiful plot right here okay right in the middle that red line right here oh that's X line on the top which is the mean value right so okay sometimes you can use M okay no big deal okay but uh, let's say this one is one hospital or one clinic okay they have a sodium value which is okay uh, average uh, that's right I told you about normal value right that's 140 but uh, you have one control okay every single day you have to uh, run control before you test patients okay now uh, first one okay uh, we check only 10 people how about that 10 patients uh, now uh, mean value right in the middle right there then 141 okay then 144 because okay one SD right here see one SD okay standard deviation was okay let's say uh, it was a three point uh, six nine but I use the uh, three point seven how about that so uh, from this one so you just add one SD right there see one SD okay two SD okay three SD you keep adding going up now you subtract okay which is a minus okay 141 minus uh, 3.7 so which is 137.3 is 